In the previous two videos, we've looked at printf and how the data conversion characters work and how this argument list over here works and how the next line feature works in Java. But now we're going to take a look at the different ways that printf can be used to format, which is its intended purpose. We have all of these possible options between the percent sign and the data conversion type. We can talk about the argument index, meaning which argument are we going to use, flags, are we going to left justify, right justify, width, how many words would we like inside of there, and precision, how many numbers after the decimal place. And in this video, we're going to look specifically at precision and how that affects the formatting of an element in the formatting string. So here you can see that there's no precision specified and we have the number 10.1234. So when that prints out, it does not print out 10.1234, it prints out 10.1234 with two zeros at the end. The reason for this is that when no precision is given, percent %f will default to six decimal places. So that's why you have the four decimal places here and then two trailing zeros because no precision is specified. And also E, capital E, capital G, and lowercase g, they all have a default precision of six if no precision is specified. So they will add the trailing zeros if necessary. In these sets, I have added precision. You can see them indicated by blue here. And make sure you always have the period or decimal separator before the amount of precision you would like. And let's see how this turns out. You can see with 0, .0, that means I want no decimal place. It just drops the decimal place and gives you the integer in front of the decimal separator. Next, we have one decimal place, two decimal place, three decimal place. Now, you can notice that the number is changing. It is not 12.345 as it is up here. It's 12.346. And the reason is, is if the number right here that would have been right here is higher or equal to five, it will round this number up. And we can see that happens all the way down this list. And you can probably guess why there is a zero here. It has to do with the precision of eight being specified. There are seven numbers after this decimal separator in num here. And it prints out those seven numbers and adds that trailing zero because we specified eight as the precision. So you can see that precision is the number of digits after the decimal. G is kind of an odd duck because it has the possibility of rounding and it goes through a formula in order to print it out. So it might not always print out the way that you expect with precision. Also, you might be surprised that floating point numbers are not the only thing that can use precision with printf. I've given you several examples down here, string, boolean, hash code, integer, character, and then our end of line character, and we're going to see what happens with each of them. It works with the first three, but does not work with the last three. So with a string, if you specify a precision, hello will become he, because he is the first two letters of hello. Three here, which is interesting with boolean, instead of true with an E, it just gives you the first three letters, T-R-U. The hash code gives you the first two elements in the address that is printed out. So on my computer in memory, it would be 5E and it would have other digits going on here. But because we specified precision, it would cut them off. But with integers, you cannot specify precision. With characters, you cannot specify precision. That would be kind of difficult because a character is only one character. And how would you add more spaces to it? That would be difficult. And then an end of line character, it wouldn't make sense to add precision to it. So hopefully you can see from this video that precision deals with the number of digits after the decimal place in most cases. There are a few exceptions with string, boolean, and hash code where you can use precision and it will lop off part of the intended data. And precision is just the first tool in formatting strings using printf. 